modular soldering complex. IK650 has been developed for removal and installation of SMT components by thermoprofile reflowing of solder. The complex in a full set includes Top heater IK650 Pro with controller, bottom heater of NP series, in our case it is NP3424AB Pro, air cooler FC500 and temperature control sensor on tripod holder PDS300. Choosing a working place for complex, please keep in mind the following criteria. A working place should has enough space and there have to no obstacles for top heater holder arm rotation. Soldering fume extraction available. 10 amperes power supply line is available. All sockets have earthing and air cooler's case is connected to central earthing line. Computer with specification presented in software manual or higher is also available. Before starting a complex assembly, study modules into correction diagram presented in manual and make sure in complete set of components delivered. Find a place for button heater. It shouldn't be a desk edge to avoid effect from room air convection. Place a top heater holder behind and at a central axis of button heater. Top heater controller model is IK10CD Pro. Fix the top heater holder to a disc and release arm fixing screws. For a walk in temperature, read out thermograph or for reflow oven models, place controllers nearby. For more convenience, controller of top heater on top. For work under program control, we will not need to have controllers in a working zoom, and this can be removed. However, some operators prefer to use controllers display readout information. A cooler has to be situated along bottom heater side with some gap. Adjust its height and tightening screws in a way which let you direct airflow to a soldering working zone. You can always change the direction of airflow by rotating cooler case around horizontal axis. Connect control sensor at tripod holder to terminals on the backside one of controllers. It doesn't matter of which one. Find a place for computer or monitor. During a work you will need to trace process data and react to that, in due time, by introduction possible changes, for what you will need both keyboard and mouse. Therefore, monitor, keyboard and mouse are to be always in prompt access. If you use a laptop, please place it beside of working zone, to avoid making obstacles for observation and complex part movement in a process. However, you always need to see laptop monitor with process data. Connect both heater's power cables to its controllers and tighten fixing nuts at terminals to prevent undesirable disconnection. Connect interface cables from controllers and air cooler to PC USB ports. Connect power adapter to air cooler. Plug in controllers and air cooler power cords into power supply sockets. System is ready for job now. Set up thermoprocenter software to your computer in accordance with software manual and computer specification. Adjust vertical position screw on top heater holder and its horizontal slides fixing nuts to a force convenient for you. Lay down control sensor on working zone of a PCB supporting control sensor tripod arm with your hand. Do it with a reasonable care to prevent sensor damage. Correct positioning of control sensor is a critical feature of the process. Please read information about it in manuals and other documents available on your CD. Take a special care about anti-static protection. All operators have to work with anti-static straps and preferable in gloves. Make sure about absence of collateral negative factors, which can affect the temperature of the process, such as opened windows, doors, ventilators and air conditioners. Turn both controllers on by pushing switches on its side. 
Consequence doesn't matter. Control and monitors. Display current temperature of heaters and control sensor. Light on indicators on air cool top tells that device is on. Download ThermoProcenter program by choosing Refer icon on desktop of your computer. Further information about complex operation is available in part 2 of this video manual, software manual on a compact disc supplied with equipment, or at our web page in Internet.